people were mostly in agreement with a mandate for the IGF to be basically and foremost a discussion forum, a place for the exchange of ideas for people who then go to other organizations to which they belong and with these fresh exchanges and learning from others would go and start things or continue things or stop things but would act in this other forum. However, there was also a large number of people with uh, concern that by meeting in a place like the forum with this open uh, and diverse format uh, would be inclined to take action from their words, to make these words into concrete uh, actions that have concrete outcomes or results. Uh, the view that was expressed at the time by Nitin Desai, I think he was the first who, who came with this figure of speech, was that surely people would come together into coalitions or groupings that would be dynamic, that would be evolving, that would form according to purpose and maybe grow if there was enough uh, interest uh, within the group and then outside it and uh, follow on on, uh, on some of the issues that would come out here like accessibility, like uh, who knows what. Uh, that's where the name dynamic coalitions uh, first started in my recollection within the multi-stakeholder advisory group for the IGF. Uh, there have been a number of efforts started on different subjects. They have been working. There's groupings that meet several times a year in different places. They meet online. They discuss. They are putting forward proposals for action for different organizations and so on. Uh, for the one that we are meeting today here, uh, the uh, proposal was put forward by Shiva Subramanian Mutusami, uh, as I mentioned, from ISO Internet Society Chennai, uh, to start a group that would discuss in more depth and maybe find ways uh, to interact with organizations that are already out in the field to identify, promote, and care for the core values of the Internet, those things that make the Internet be the Internet, and that if you remove them, it stops being the Internet. If you attack them, you are attacking the Internet. There has been much speech about these values during the last few days. There has been uh, a workshop. The president to this day is a workshop that we held last year, also organized by Shiva, in which I was by a similar circumstance uh, made to chair uh, in Sharm el Sheikh. And we also have a president, which you don't all share, so that will be on screen later, uh, which is a workshop that was organized in the W3C uh, conference in Raleigh, North Carolina this year, uh, which I, again, was privileged to chair uh, on, uh, on the same issue of the core values of the Internet. And in both Sharm el Sheikh and, Nor and Raleigh, we had the privilege of having some of the uh, founders of the Internet that make the doers and standardizers of the first technologies that came together, as well as people from many other walks of life.